Let me ask you this, the flip side of his flip side, have you ever <laughs> flipped it against a writer, what a writer put on the page and what you did didn't work? Okay. 99.9% of the time, they're all happy. Mm-hmm. Because they get credit. They think people don't know if he did that. And they think mm -hmm. they wrote it. They're going to get credit. Nine times they'll be like, what did he say? What did he say? Because the place <laughs> is coming down. Right. What did he say? What did he say? Mm -hmm. Oh! <laughs> and they, they like it because they know mm -hmm. they're going to get the credit for it. Mm -hmm. But, but, <laughs> Ed Weinberger <laughs> did have a rule. And the last three shows, I can tell you this. One of the rules after the first season was nobody, nobody can ad lib except Miguel Nunez. I've had that on two or three shows. Mm. Because most people don't know how they think because I do it. They can just mm -hmm. jump and do it. And they think, hey, and they're always at just a beat. And always, there's a rhythm. There's a flow and a rhythm to comedy. Mm -hmm. If you throw it in there, it's got to fall in the rhythm. Most people throw it in there. Hey, what the fuck? No, nope, it fucked up the whole rhythm of the beat in the moment. Mm -hmm. So you got to be able to know how to ad lib. And that's what people don't know how to do. But <laughs> I remember one time we went to Ed Weinberger. And, and most people work with Ed Weinberger except me. If you say his name to most people who work with him on, a, on past shows, Hey, Ed Weinberger, what? what, what? <laughs> but Ed Weinberger is like this. All right, move that over there like that. Because he knows what he wants. Move that over there like that. Genius. And me and Rob, I said, Robin, what if we go? Blah, 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 blah. Yeah. She goes, okay, let's ask Ed. So we walked out. I said, Ed. He said, yeah, what, what? I said, hey, listen, I want to try this. He's like, all right, all right, go ahead, tell me. All right, no, no, put it on that side. Okay, so I'm going to gonna say that. He's like, oh, no, that's not funny. That's not funny. All right, let's go, no, no, no. <laughs> so we walk back. The night of the taping, I'm like, Robin, let's try that. Come on. She said, no, you know, Ed. Oh, I forgot. His rule was, guys, even at the, and this is unheard of in this business, at the table read, at the very first table read, when Ed Weinberger, the biggest writer in the history of the business, genius, wrote the script, you're still allowed. If you come in there, like me, I would go through it all night and go, and you do it at the table read, ah, ha, ha. you see Ed at the thing going like this, right? <laughs> and you could try anything, anybody, right? And he'll go back. Yeah. So he'll put an X by it, that means go back to where it was. One rule, if you change something here and you, and, 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 and you come up with something at the table read, if it's not in the script the next day, let it go. Mm. I don't want to hear it no more. That mm -hmm. was his rule, okay. So I said, Robert, come on, let's just do it. Ed, Ed, come on, he wasn't even listening to us yesterday. You saw him going, no, 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 he didn't even really hear us. She said, okay, all right. So the audience is there, and you know, I, I can get a laugh anytime I want on Spark. Yeah. I, I can grab an audience and, and, and hold them as long as I want, make them laugh, as long as I want, whenever I want. I don't give a damn if it's a funeral scene, whatever I want, right? <laughs> so I go in there and I say, like, we're doing the scene, the audience is there, five, four, three, two, and eight, and we're shooting. No, no, no. And then I go, but I'm going to go to my dad. Crickets. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't never been afraid of air before in my life. Crickets. I look at Robin, she walks away. And I'm like this. <laughs> it comes out. He said, okay. He won't get mad at me because, you know. He said, all right. You came to me on Tuesday. It's about 3 30. I was talking to John, da da da, and da da da. We were relocating the da da da. You asked me if it wasn't funny. I told you it wasn't funny then. <laughs> and it wasn't funny then. I, yeah. <laughs> and that's all he said. Yeah. Did you, but, no, but he embarrassed me because he, all the folks there, you know, they go, eh. And then he, while, 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 while it didn't say cut, while they were like, is this crickets? He walked into the shot. <laughs> <laughs> I love oh, it. Oh, shit. I love it. That was so awesome. He subtly put you that on was, the spot. <laughs> yeah. But 99.99.99% .99 .99 of the time, and that just never happened. That was the only time in yeah. my life I did an ad lib that didn't work. Wow. Don't be scared was that. Yeah, yeah. I'm home court, standing trial. Why ain't I see you round back when I was down? Karma's on the way. What goes around comes around. Karma's on the way. There's nothing you could do now. You gotta pay.